Now, let me tell you something. Last month, I sold over 20 plots of land within 14 days, and the list plot was of 4.5 million naira. Now, top three things that made that possible. Number one, my name, my brand, quality leads, and of course, a lot of things in between. Now, let me even shock you. Before I posted a formal video of this particular estate, I already sold 10 plots out of the 20 plots. Now, if you truly and sincerely want to become a top-selling real estate agent or broker, you need to pay attention to your mindset, your content, your branding, your lead generation stream. Note, emphasis on the word stream. I didn't say just lead generation. And I'm going to explain this. And your ability to close. And again, this is a skill. Closing is a skill and you need to pay attention to it because you can generate quality leads and not be able to close. The truth is that selling real estate is not easy as I've always said, but if you can crack a code of selling, if you can sell real estate, it will completely change your life forever. And one secret to being able to sell real estate is to learn how to sell yourself because in the real estate sector, selling is not just about marketing the product. You must learn to also sell yourself and that is a place of branding. And now we're gonna look into that as we proceed. I started investing in real estate before I started selling real estate. In other words, I had already fallen in love with real estate as a product before I started selling it to anybody. And right there is a secret. So beyond the fact that investing in real estate can help you sell better, one mistake you should never make is selling real estate and not investing into it as a realtor. Because at the end of the day, you have to build wealth for yourself as well. Before I go to the next part of the course, let me add that selling real estate is a skill. And that skill requires knowledge it comes from the place of possessing the right knowledge not just the right knowledge but a body of knowledge and this body of knowledge consists of seven key things unless i forget you must also become somebody who can sell if you want to sell consistently emphasis on the word become because until you become that person that can sell real estate consistently every sale is going to be an accident and of course you know my principle and the pattern of being a seller and yes you definitely need a mentor because in the real estate sector naturally it is already high risk and you need guidance to be able to not just sell consistently but to stay at the top because the higher you go the higher the demands and the sacrifices and everything in between that you will need to stay at the top in the real estate sector two general ways that can guarantee getting quality leads number one online and offline now, there are a lot of things in between these two. And as a real estate agent that wants to make sales consistently, you must create a proper balance between these two. While you maintain this to continuously get passive sales, you must also carry out this so that you are able to generate some amazing quality leads. As someone who sells real estate myself, I understand the role of selling offline as well as paying attention to your online game. Trust me, for you to be able to sell consistently, you must create a proper balance. Sell online as though you are not selling offline and sell offline as though you are not selling online.